Hi everyone, my name is Carla and in this video I'm going to show you what it's like working from Bali. I'm currently staying at Bali Bustle and this is a co-living slash co-working space. So we have a small studio with a small kitchen, our own bathroom, a small balcony and downstairs you have a co-working space where you can work with other co-workers and the internet speed is very fast downstairs. No one has told me before I came to Bali that finding good internet is actually quite hard. Went to many cafes before and the internet there was very slow it was very difficult to load youtube videos upstairs you also have a small gym downstairs you have a pool where i'm sitting at right now and next to the co-working space you also have a cafe where you have a discount when you live here a small 10 percent discount and all this for only 16 euro per night it's very affordable without further ado let's get started with our day so before we can start our day, we have to find some coffee, of course. I'm going to a cafe right now that's very nearby Bali Bustle. It's kind of a Japanese vibe cafe. I'm currently walking to it. It's only a four minute walk. I'm too scared to drive a scooter here in Bali because the traffic is really difficult. Yeah, now I'm walking to the cafe. thought that I was getting scammed at the cafe because I gave more money than what the coffee cost and I didn't got any change but then later on I saw that the prices on the menu were exclusive tax so I actually gave too little money I gave 24 when it was actually 26 and I thought it was 23 so I thought I would receive change but at the end I gave too little money and he thought like whatever I'm the scammer I am now at the Bali Bissell cafe and I'm going to work here and then also eat some brunch. I have a chicken katsu sandwich with bulgogi sauce and this was only 45k which is around 3 euro for this huge plate. And I have sweet potato fries. Mm. It's really good. It's almost 5 p.m. right now and we are heading to Seminyak Beach to see the sunset. One of my goals is to be more social and to make new friends and to go out of my comfort zone. And I saw a girl making pictures on her own and making selfies of her and the sunset. And I thought, oh, I want to help her to make beautiful photos of her because I know how it's like when you're on your own and you want to make good pictures of yourself. I gathered all my courage and asked her if she wanted me to help her make pictures. And then she said no. And I got rejected and I feel awful. And <sighs> we are now going to eat dinner at Korea Chicken for some Korean food. We have Korean fried chicken and they gave us six different sauces to try. This is so hot. It's good. We have champong and yakshe. Mm. That's spicy. Yeah. Hi guys, it's a new day and we are starting today off with a gym session. It's now 8.30 a.m. Kind of tired. So today is going to be an egg day. And as a pre-workout, I'm going to eat mango steam. It's my favorite fruit. Wow, look how pretty they are.
We are done gymming. I had a good session. And now we are going to eat a post-workout slash breakfast because it's now 10 a.m. I think. We are now at Basel Kitchen and every dish is around 50k, which is a very good deal. And today is Tuesday. That means it's Taco Tuesday. We have a lot of different dishes from breakfast to protein shakes, also tacos and also the Thai food. Very different things. Wow, look at these tacos. And these were only 15k per taco, which is 1 euro. <laughs> Little more than 1 euro. That's the service not included. And this is my ex Benedict. We are now back at our place and we are going downstairs to the co-working space to do some work until dinner probably. p.m. right now and we're going to have dinner Basically how my life has been in Bali. I've been here for a little over a week and I haven't really done anything exciting in Bali but if I'm going to do something exciting I will definitely bring you guys along with me. Don't forget to like and subscribe because I'm so excited to share my journey with you. Mm -hmm.